just didn't get good. Can you pull me this water? Oh, actually, the sun might be breaking. We're getting ready for the Producers um, Guild Awards this evening, and then, of course, the Screen Actors Guild that's coming up. Yeah, but the actually, weather's, tomorrow evening. weather's scheduled to be this bad again tomorrow, so. Yuck, yuck, yuck. Rain tonight, more bad tomorrow. Actually, you know, see, part of it is when they know that the weather's going to be like this, they do... Um, they do cover it when they're all going down. But it doesn't count carpet. when the stuff comes in sideways. <laughs> I know. And it makes a mess. And most of those gowns are all borrowed. Yeah. We've been we've been to the Oscars when everything was, co they covered everything you could think of. And when you got in there, you're walking around in water on top of the plastic. And then when they take, they, you really don't squeegee the plastic off so it does get on the carpet. So. Yeah. And of course, we have Old Cam with us for comments on the headlines of today. And it's all over for the Republicans. Well, you know, the, the Democrats are, all, are fanning out all over television for gun control, for immigration, and gay marriage rights, which basically they're on the opposite side of the entire country on all of them because they want to give total amnesty to all the 11 million that are immigrants. They never get it through the Senate nor the what? House. They want to do, they want, they, they want the United States government to pass a gay rights. Civil Rights Act, which is never going to happen, and they're not going to get gun control. They said this morning it has very little chance of getting by the Democrats in the Senate. Mm -hmm. So, so it just they said that Obama they expected to do it all by executive action, and then he will be taken to court, and every single thing he's done will be tossed out. Uh, and trial in India gang rape right, begins a newly created court. I know they created a built a courthouse to hold a. a a trial of which everybody's going to get freed at. But what they really? want, well, the courts have already ruled that it's, yeah, there, are, there is no state that they circumnavigated the judicial system in India to bring these people to trial for a show trial, which means they've, and, a, and it is a democracy, they violated the rights of all of the people that are on trial. Mm -hmm. So therefore, it means that uh, they, they knew they were going to do that, and by violating their rights, they have to re they'll release them all. So. In Spanish, newspaper, sorry for false fo um, false photo of Venezuela's Chavez. Well, the, the, the problem is there are no good photos of him because he's dying. I mean, he's got, he has terminal cancer. Well, why are they calling it a false photo? Because or they're just saying it's a bad Because picture. they're getting oil from Venezuela. Mm. That's why. Uh, and never leave shell-shocked Mali residents tell France. Well, yeah, because they're, uh, the Al-Qaeda, whom Obama says that he struck down, basically is, has control of a whole country now. They have a country. And, you know, the, basically the whole universe is pissed off at our president because mm -hmm. he's taking his victory stroll. And then basically, the, while he's doing it, they're, they're doing exactly what everyone knew they would do. As soon as we started pulling out, they would move in, and that's they're doing it with a vengeance. They control mm -hmm. Libya, they control Egypt, they control parts of uh, of, uh, of Saudi Arabia, parts of every country. Now they got a whole country that's theirs again, like Afghanistan. Oh. And the day the last of our troops is out, they'll take back Afghanistan. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's why some people are saying never leave, never leave. Although there's other people that are leaving too, and it has more to do with citizenship. Yeah. Tina Turner is the latest. Yeah, well, because they can't, their taxes are killing them. I, mean, I heard, I heard an arrogant, uh, I, I, one of the persons said, well, you're an arrogant son of a bitch, saying that, well, these people make too much money as it is. And they, they said the trick is they made the money. Mm -hmm. And uh, and they don't they you know, they shouldn't have to give sixty nine percent of what they make. That's a lot. Well, yeah, they said they can't pay their bills on it because their bills are based upon what they were making before, and not on what the government wants to take from them now. And they don't. They said the people are leaving for Christ's sake. They 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 said well, we're, Obama plans to tax the people even if they leave. The, Obama's plan is to do what a lot of cities, in the United States, do now. If a professional athlete comes into their state and works, they now tax him for working in the state. You know, which baseball players don't like it, football players don't oh, like I it. Oh, I could just imagine their accountants because what, it's like they play, okay, for example, basketball, they go, how many different states or cities do they go? They oh, have to, they get hit by a state, or a state and city taxes everywhere they play and it's just, it's, it's not what right. Mess. It's the same way as what they, uh, I mean, they said last, this morning you were talking on, um, on one of the wall, on one of Bloomberg things about the fact he said that there that Bloomberg or that Mickelson should be ashamed of himself because he thought he was a loyal Democrat complaining about sixty nine percent 
And it's, they, they said it's not actually 69% because every state he plays golf in hits him with a tax. Mm -hmm. If he wins, they take the money out. That's before California takes its money out and before the, and, and that's Oh, right. so they get they get taxed for where they're playing plus California. That's right. Plus... You, can, you can get taxed by the city, the county, and the state where you're playing. Oh my gosh. And you're, but when you get back to California, you're paying the full tax on what you were you uh, made in that state, even though you didn't take it out of the state. Oh. I mean, I, it, it was so bad in England one time that a, a championship boxing match was held and boxing match was held in in, in England, and they charged 140 percent in taxes, and they wouldn't let the boxer leave this leave the country until he paid his taxes. He owed more money, more money than he made. More money than he made, and they wouldn't let him leave until he paid it. And uh, my buddy said he went into the embassy, and the embassy took him out. And they, they're basically the whole champion. They they stopped holding that thing in the country. It's just you had major stars moving to the. I mean, put it. So Lawrence Olivier was doing Kodak commercials because the taxes were taking everything he made in England. They busted uh, Wilford, Wilford Hyde White. They broke one actor after another. Why do you think that? that no major movies were done in England for a long time. Mm. And sports are a civil right for the disabled. The oh USA. yeah, Obama now says you must provide equal athletic opportunities for the disabled, uh, which means what? you have to allow the disabled to play on, in the sporting events or cancel the events. But they said if you make a sporting league, uh, if the, the schools can get together, including the colleges, and create a disabled league, that must be equally funded with the with the others, and they said it, that what it means is they're going to kill all sports in the country now. And that is ridiculous. Because what happened when they did the uh, the Title IX thing, all they did was cut out all of the sports where people didn't have to have many skills to participate, and those were the first ones to go. Then the other sports, and they, they basically you're down to like. Ten, you know, tennis and um, football and baseball. Tennis, football and baseball, track and field, and, and mostly all. They went. A lot of colleges went from eighty or ninety sports down to a core of four or five now because oh. they had to fund women's sports at the same thing. Now they're going to have to fund disabled sports. Yeah, you know, and crazy. the one guy. Said, I mean, I mean, part of it is is like the comp individuals fund the sports based on. It's their alma mater. They watch football, yeah, so a lot of them play football. They're not going to find a thing where you know that. Uh, the, first of all, the, the, the disabled cannot participate in football. Right. But they are demanding they be allowed to participate in football. Oh God. I mean, if you. Have, I mean, they they would have. Okay, to make them equal, they would have to try out just like everybody else would to be on the team. No, right? but they don't have to. And under Title IX, if a woman wants to play in men's sports, they have to allow her. If they don't allow her on the team, they can file a complaint. What happens is, is they then create, they either dump the sport or create a similar sport for the females. Mm -hmm. And the colleges went bust doing that. Yeah. And will women have to register for the draft? No, because it's going to be, it's not, it's going to be, uh, the, the equality is, it's all, okay, Obama, we're, the Republicans are anti-woman and we're going to fix that problem. Um, I was listening to a guy last night. He said they can't. There's a. He said if he had uh, Lucy Lawless as Zena, you know, warrior princess standing alongside him, he'd be very happy. But when I have somebody that's five foot, you know, the reason why there is a size for men in the military is because they can't carry the backpacks. Mm -hmm. There is no size for women in the military. So you could, you know, that five foot two inch guy that's not allowed. He's being replaced by a five foot two inch woman. That is being ordered into the units that cannot carry the equipment. That's not. Right. It, it doesn't make any difference to what, a bomb. What is it? The, the men have to be a certain size. You cannot be below a certain size to get. And that's this. what height and weight. Are that's right. Say. And they they put women in the planes that weren't tall enough for the. Their, because the equipment's made, so your legs have to reach. That's right. And they said women are built different than the males. Everything has to be rediggered for the women, and, uh, and they said well. They point out the Israeli army is done differently. Well, the women don't fight in combat units. Mm -hmm. The women fight in mechanized units. Ah, but Obama totally. has demanded. Uh, uh, Obama is all across the spectrum, not in where they can, where the weight, you know, size difference makes no difference if you're in a tank or if you're in a mechanized unit and you're driving something. It's no different. But. If you're on a battlefield, you cannot carry 70 pounds. I, I carry 50 pounds of computer stuff with me every day. Mm. I want to see most light women carry that with them. 
I wouldn't carry it. I know you won't. That's why I carry it. <laughs> Plastic wives defend Beverly Hills decisions. Uh, I know. It, that's ridiculous. Is that a new show? Yeah, it's another television show. Oh. And a Monty Bubbleism from the Mark Twain of the Animal Kingdom. Uh, uh Okay, this one. Just because the government says you have to doesn't mean you actually have to. Oh, that sounds like taxes. Yeah. Well, they have decided now. Oh, the sun came out. I know. 